Space propulsion got a boost thanks to a Georgia Tech undergraduate student. And one of our favorite Georgia Tech grads, Melissa Nord, is sharing his story. As a third-year undergraduate, Dalton Ludke made an out-of-this-world impact during his NASA Pathways internship, designing a new type of rocket engine. Created a small um, subscale engine to test um, a new combustion process. Meet Marlin. A marlin as a fish is very large, and the engine of his is, of course, very small, so it's, it's just kind of funny. Marlin stands for Maturation of Additive Really Little Engine and is the small version of Ludkey's new detonation engine. Current space missions use big, constant pressure engines. Think of the big cylindrical rocket boosters as it lifts off with that final countdown. But Ludkey's design shrinks that down to a ring. That's up to a 70% reduction in length, making it much more fuel efficient. Putting a um, really hybrid or really efficient hybrid engine in a um, pickup truck while maintaining all of the power. He built his engine using 3D printing with a laser fusing metal powders. Ludke had experience with this through the Aeromaker space at Tech and years before through his family business with his dad. On his second engine test, it worked. So it was really awesome to see not only that it worked, but that our clear configuration um, worked as well so we could observe what was happening. The excitement even more thrilling for his NASA colleagues. All like just very shocked, <laughs> like not shocked that it worked, but very proud and happy that it worked. A reminder, even the smallest fish in the big sea can make a difference with Marlin soaring into space in the future. Hopefully within the next decade or two. Um, and these are things wow. that people normally don't uh, make until they've been at an organization yeah. like that for decades. So that's the comparison. I mean, it's really making it more fuel efficient. Mm -hmm. And from here, it's small. It's mm -hmm. a prototype so they can test it, every little piece of it. How are they sure going to continue perfect. to test it over well, and over? All these companies that are invested in space travel, they will get to test each little part of it. They'll find the perfect kind of makeup of it then they can send it to space. Right. How cool to know you were a part of that and making it come to life. I mean, he's a pretty, pretty incredible kid. Very yeah. intelligent. So props to you, Dalton. Let's get a little shout out, though, to the whole Georgia Tech community with a live look right now at Tech Tower.